This is Channel 11, Carnegie Science Center weather. And good evening. We've had some reports from our weather watchers in the outlying areas and suburbs that the roads are slippery in spots. So any rain that we had today is the runoff from the roads and the hillsides. They're all frozen tonight, so watch out. You may hit upon a slippery spot just like that. Right now, our temperatures are below freezing, and they're going to remain that way through all of next week. Our current temperature at the Science Center is 26. That's the uh, low for the day. Our high was 35 around midnight, and then the temperatures dropped all day long. Our humidity is at 90 percent. Winds out of the northwest, six miles an hour. The barometer is rising, 30.19 inches of mercury, and we've had just a trace of precipitation, like two one-hundredths of an inch of uh, precip, and that holds true for the airport as well. Our latest satellite picture reveals lots of clouds. That's keeping the temperatures up a little bit today. That's why tonight we're in the 20s, and we were in the 20s earlier today. As we fly down to the Florida region along the Atlantic coast, anybody doing any driving, you can see they're pretty well socked in with clouds. This will hold true for most of tomorrow at the uh, Super Bowl game tomorrow. Temperatures will be in the low 40s. They'll have rain outside the dome, but not too good weather down in the south either. What we have for uh, tonight, our 11 o'clock temperatures, 22 in Brookfield, Steubenville 27, Lenora 26, Franklin Park 26, 27 in Delmont and Connellsville, Boswell 25, our friends up in Brockway 23, and Harrisville is also 23. So everybody's in the 20s, which isn't too bad. Tomorrow the sun will come up about 7.33 in the morning, set at 5.33. We have some sporadic uh, flowers and showers around. The flowers aren't blooming, but the showers are. So with those snow showers that are falling, that's what's helping to make some of the roads slippery as well. We'll have a few flurries overnight, no accumulation. And the good news in our forecast is the big snow for Sunday night and Monday will not develop. And what does develop will miss Pittsburgh. It'll stay to the south of Pittsburgh and to the east of Pittsburgh. Some light snow for Sunday night into Monday in association with an upper level disturbance that's moving in from the northwest. So it looks like a cooler than normal week ahead for us, but that is not unusual for Pittsburgh this time of winter. So those that were forecasting lots of snow tomorrow night, out of the question, not going to happen. Right now, here's what's going to happen. Tonight, partly to mostly cloudy and low of 16 degrees. Tomorrow, believe it or not, we're going to start off with partly sunny skies in the morning, then increasing clouds towards the afternoon. 28 degrees for high tomorrow. Some night light snow or flurries tomorrow night, overnight, our low will be 16. Then on Monday, what we're going to have, we'll have partly cloudy skies, and also on Monday, a chance for some snow showers, 26 and 10. Party blasts will come in on Tuesday and on Thursday. Tuesday, these are the temperatures for uh, the Science Center, 20 and 5. Look at Wednesday, 20 and 8. And then that'll be another blast coming in. Overnight, it will be zero on Thursday. Temperatures well below the normal high of 34 all through next week. Yeah, we can't seem to get away from one or the other. I guess it's winter and we should quit complaining, right? <laughs> We're not going to get the snow, but we'll get the cold temperatures. I can deal with that a lot better. Thanks a lot, Bill.